Sister so, so, so your Energy, Brother Wisdom, what's going on? Um, one of the subscribers had said on that last message did about how she was like, you know, she felt alone. She said she felt alone dealing with, you know, uh, and, and, and this battle. And she says, you know, we I know we are all working together, but sometimes I feel alone in this battle. And one thing all of us must remember is that no matter how much we are by ourselves or seem like we are by ourselves, we are never by ourselves. I want you to remember the Ascended Master Simeon Toko. All right? The Ascended Master named Simeon Toko, who was in South Africa and the Belgian army, and he stood in front of them and told them, you're not gonna kill my people. And the Belgian army had a, um, they had a, um, a contract with, I don't know who they had a contract with, but basically they were supposed to, they were supposed to take over South Africa. They were supposed to kill off, kill off so many brothers and sisters or whatever. And Simeon Toko was there. And what did he do? He, he, he wasn't alone. There was no fear in him. There was no fear in him. And what did he do? He manifested an army of angelic beings. And when you talk about the seraphims and the cherubims, you know, these beings stand probably about four to five foot tall. But they literally, you know, one of them just picked up a fucking tank and threw it several feet. He picked up a tank with one hand. See, you're not alone. You're never alone. And this is why it's important, brothers and sisters, for you to practice manifesting things. Pra practice all your kinetics. Practice, do unto your meditation. Practice manifesting things. It, everything that's manifested is mental. Don't expect for things to happen right away, but you know, it's like you gotta keep on churning. You gotta keep on churning. It's like, you know, you, you, you're getting on the roller skates. And you're not just gonna get on the roller skates and skate. You're gonna fall a couple times. Things are not gonna happen just the way you want them to happen. You're gonna fall a few times. You're gonna you're gonna uh, uh, scrape your leg or whatever. You know, it's, it's not going to be instantaneous, but you keep on practicing and it'll come. And before you know it, you will have manifested your first uh, uh, thought. You will have manifested your first thought and you will, have, you will have been like, wow, this is what I did. This is what I did. So you're never alone. You have a legion of angelic, demonic forces, beings within you, all around you. And all you have to do is tap into that energy within yourself. That's all you got to do. So all you got to do is tap into that inner energy, that inner energy that that literally opens up every gateway of power. Understand, understand, overstand, brothers and sisters, that we have been miseducated in so many different fashions. And the miseducation was designed so that we would not manifest, so that we would not tap into, so that we would not evolve. That's what it was all about. That's what it's all about. So we have to understand, overstand, understand, brothers and sisters, that, hey, you know what? We're coming into this last battle. We coming into this last battle and we gotta bring this thing to the motherfucking, you know, curtains. We gotta open up the curtain. Like fucking uh, uh, Dorothy with um, <laughs> Wizard of Oz. We gotta open up the curtain on these motherfuckers so that we can see how powerless they are. 
they want to hide behind the shadows and want to send their men, but we about to take shit to the, to the fucking streets with these motherfuckers. We about to clean the flow up with their ass. That's what the, that's what's going to happen. So the whole key point is to understand, understand, understand that you're never alone. You are a spirit. You have a soul that communicates with you as well as you have a body that communicates with you. You are a spirit with a soul and a body. And all three of you can communicate. Your body will communicate with you. Yes. Your body communicate with your soul. Your body communicate with your spirit. So communicate with your spirit. So communicate with your with your body. You know, it, it, it goes all the way around. It's that trinity. But you're never alone. You got the 72 demonic forces of Croatia that's within you. And you never, ever be alone, brothers and sisters. You'll never be alone. Waiting. Remember, you will never be alone. You will never be on your own. Remember that. Remember that. You have the ability to open up so many gateways within yourself that will literally unlock all types of Entities that will unlock all types of beings that will be there to fight with you. You're never alone. You gotta learn how to manifest. You gotta learn how to go within yourself. You gotta learn how to become more powerful within yourself. You gotta learn how to become more fearless within yourself. Remember, your faith is your inner belief, so you gotta increase your faith. You gotta increase your inner belief. Know who you are. Worship yourself. I am glory. I am power. I am almighty. I am the everything. There is nothing that, that can defeat me. There is no man. There is no woman who can take me down. I am the most powerful. I have the abilities and the powers of nature and the cosmos. You have to say these affirmations all the time. And if not all the time on a consistent basis. So that you will be able to... Um, Conjure up or manifest when you conjure something up, you literally manifest it. So you be able to conjure up or manifest an army when necessary that will fight with you, that will fight for you. As Simeon Toko was fighting against the Belgium army in South Africa, what happened? He was using powers and energies from within himself. The cherubims and the seraphims that are around him, they were using their powers. And all of them were being shot at by this by the Belgian army. All of them were being shot at, and the bullets did not penetrate their bodies, and they killed the majority of the army, the ones that didn't retreat. You see what I'm saying? You're never alone. But we've got to learn how to manifest the armies, the beings that are all all around us there. And and, and and what it is, is what did Simeon Toko did? He opened up a realm that was within this realm. And he brought these armies. These, there, there are those who are waiting to come through gateways to help us fight, to help us destroy this system. Which means that we got to put in the work, brothers and sisters. We got to put in the fucking work you got to manifest, open these gateways, build, create, design, open up your mind. This is why we talk about the, geo, uh, the, the geometrical mindset. When you begin to build and create, the geometry within you begins to calculate and multiply. See what I'm saying? No matter how big or small, the geometrical energy within you begins to go on a, on a whole nother tangent. So you must understand, overstand, understand, brothers and sisters, that 
You're never alone. You're never alone. Never, never would just you feel like you're alone. When you feel like you're in the, when you know that there's a state of danger around. Oh my goodness, I wish so many brothers and sisters who sleep in, in the system was here at this. If you if, if, if you felt like any kind of danger was around, first thing you want to do is the first thing you want to do is tap into yourself and says, I am the darkness. I am all powerful. I contain the power of every dark energy force known across cosmos. I literally am the most powerful dark energy being. I am a wizard. I am a, a sorcerer. I am a witch. I am a Sith. I mean, this, this is what you got to do. And you got to practice, 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 practice. You got to practice. When they say practice make perfect, yes, practice make perfect. So you got to practice. You got to pull in this energy. You got to literally focus on yourself. Use your crystals. Use your uh, 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 your singing bowls. Use your use your bells. Use your tuning forks. Use your everything that you, that that you can. Use use everything around you. Get yourself a, a, a piece of metal, two pieces of metal, and, and clang them together to create a frequency for you. Use your frequency generator. Use the Sofagio frequencies on, 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 the, on the YouTube channel. I mean, and, 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 and raise, your, raise your frequencies, raise your energies, go into that dark place and find your power. You've got to put in the work. Ain't nothing going to come to you, brothers and sisters. I keep telling you, ain't nothing going to come to y'all. Ain't a goddamn thing going to come to any of us. I ain't going to sit up here and say, oh, the power's going to come to me. Shit, if I don't sit and, and, and go into my state of meditation and go within myself, ain't a goddamn thing coming to me. And I can talk, 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 talk all day until nothing happens. But when I go within myself and I start tapping into that, that energy and that force, what happens? The power that is within me shows. See what I'm saying? And it's not about time. You know, people say, oh, you got to meditate for an hour, do this for an hour, do it. No, 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 no. Our ancestors knew no time. Our ancestors knew no time. They didn't know what time was. They went into meditation, and when they got out of meditation, they were out of meditation. And wasn't they didn't know if it was, oh, I did 15 minutes, or oh, I did 20 minutes. No, they didn't. They didn't know anything about no fucking time. There was no clock. They didn't put themselves on the clock. You go in meditation, and when you are finished your session of meditation. You will find yourself in an area of power that you've never known before. You are never alone, brothers and sisters. Yes, this road may be a lonely road that we travel as we go within ourselves. It's a lonely road, but you have a whole legion of demonic forces. You have a whole legion of angelic forces. You have a whole legion of all these beings helping you out. And 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 and, and the angelic forces are not what you think you, what you think they are. And the demonic forces are not what you think they are. We're gonna talk about that one day. We're gonna go into that one day. But you have a whole host, you have legions around you, with you. All you have to do is manifest the 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 these these beings to help you fight and they will be there believe in yourself know who you are strengthen yourself strengthen your belief within yourself you got to strengthen your belief within yourself because if you don't strengthen your belief within yourself you're going to be a weak ass motherfucker you got work to do Let's get this work done. This is this is what you call shadow work. This is called the spirit work. This is called going to the spirit realm, tapping into this infinite energy, this infinite power, this infinite force, bringing yourself into the balance of nature and the cosmos, brothers and sisters. All right? You're never alone. Remember that. You are never alone. You have a whole army 
around you, with you, through you. All right? Remember that. Remember that. You have a whole army. Just like Brother Simeon Toko. Whole army of cherubims and seraphims. And this is recorded. And these Saxons, they don't like talking about that because they lost a lot of men that day to several beings. And there was no other army on the other side shooting. But there were other beings that were using otherworldly powers destroying their armies and their bullets and tanks and all was not penetrating their bodies and and they were they threw tanks for several feet they they literally just disintegrated this whole freaking army so you're never alone you just got to know how to get what's inside of you on the outside of you when you find out how to get it on the outside of you, you teach others how to do the same thing. We're going to go through a session on, metaf- on manifesting. All right. Because manifesting is another word for conjuring. And it's all mental. All right, brothers and sisters. All power to the multi chakra celestial and jelly beans make chaos reign through forever and ever and ever. I remember chaos is everything. You're chaos. You're never alone. You're never alone, right? Much power to you all.